How's it going everybody? Focus like here. Today I wanted to talk to you guys about Sea of Thieves, uh, the DLC basically, and microtransactions. There's a lot of confusion going on right now when it comes to microtransactions because I hear a lot of people saying, uh, you know, they're saying, oh, there's not going to be any microtransactions, you know, everything's going to be for free. Well, you know, I'm sorry to say guys, that's not necessarily true. Uh, what Rare said is they're going to have all major content updates for free. So anything you would be considered a major part of the game, you know, a big DLC, that's going to be free. But they are going to have microtransactions, and those are going to be through uh, cosmetics. So anything you would consider a cosmetic or a smaller DLC, you know, like skins, uh, skins and uh, clothes, you know, sails for your ship, uh, all those things and uh, they also talk about pets there's gonna be pets coming in those are probably gonna be cosmetic guys those are gonna cost money I don't see the pets being free at all if they are that will be a huge surprise because at the moment it's looking like the pets are just gonna be cosmetic they're not gonna have a really big impact on the gameplay uh, so uh, yeah guys just keep that in mind all right there is gonna be microtransactions but it's going to be for all the the smaller cosmetic stuff. Anything that you would consider big, you know, major content, that's free. So, uh, Rare's talking about adding new missions, new merchants. You know, right now we have three merchants. We have the Gold Hoarder, we have the Order of the Souls, and we have the Merchant Alliance. So, they're talking about adding new merchants. So, those are probably going to be free, guys. You know? When, when they add new merchants, there's going to be new activities, you know, new missions, because each merchant is a specific mission, right? That means there's going to be new missions, which might mean there's going to be new items. So, uh, according to what Rare said, you know, the items should be free, the new items, if they have an impact on the new missions. If the new items don't affect the new missions, you know, they're probably going to cost money, guys, so... It's a really hard, uh, it's a hard line, you know, you can't, you can't really figure out what's going to cost money and what's going to be free, but for the most part, you know, you, you figure missions, that's big, that's going to be free. Ships, ships are a big part of the game, that's probably going to be free, new ships, but uh, new weapons, you know, those are probably going to cost money, unfortunately. I'm, I'm hoping not, you know. I don't want uh, this to become a completely game-breaking situation right here. Like, like, what if they added uh, weapons, but they're like, hey, you can get better loot in the new missions with the new weapons, but you have to buy the new weapons. You know, that, that gives other people an advantage. So, uh, basically, Rare doesn't want anyone to have an advantage over someone else. So, I don't think they're going to do that, guys. So, I think if there's any new items, you know, the new items have to do with the mission, you know, it's going to be free. There's, there's not going to be anything where you can pay to gain an advantage. Think about it like that. So, uh, uh, Rare basically wants to keep the game together. You know how like on, you know, Call of Duty or something, you can buy a, you can buy a map, you can buy a zombies map, and then... You know, you're, you're pretty much secluded to everyone who owns that map. You know, no one who doesn't own that map, you're not going to play with them, right? Rare doesn't want that here. They want everyone to play with each other no matter what. There's not going to be, there's not going to be no way of secluding each other. No one's going to have advantage over each other. So when you think about it in that sense, you can pretty much predict which DLCs are going to be free and cost money, guys. All right? So uh, there you guys have it. I just wanted to clear up uh, clear up this confusion a little bit, so uh, keep it in mind guys, big DLC, free, a uh, small cosmetic DLC, uh, it's going to cost money, and there's not going to be anything uh, where you can gain an advantage, so anyone who likes to just spend all kinds of money and gain an advantage, you know, you're out of luck, you know, go play a different game, so, alright, there you guys go, focus lag out, please like and subscribe.